Hi, zookeepers. Welcome to the Zoo Crew Alphabet Show. Today, we're going to learn about x-ray fish and the letter X. Okay, now do you know what habitat I'm in right now? Okay, here's a clue. I'm underwater in a huge fish tank. Mm -hmm. Okay, now normally I would bring my zoo map, but I didn't want to bring it in this fish tank and get it all wet. So we're going to look up here. Okay, and I'm going to give you three choices and you guess what habitat I'm in. So are we in the aquatic habitat? or the swamp habitat, or the desert habitat. <laughs> okay, all right, you're right. It's the aquatic habitat. Very good. Now, you might have seen an x-ray fish in your local pet store in a small tank, but we're in our big, huge tank at our zoo. Okay, zookeepers, are you ready to go? on our zoo adventure? Guess who is gonna get us started? You're right, Zookeeper Zach. Hello, zookeepers. Welcome to our zoo. Now let me tell you, you've never seen animals like these before. We call them the zoo crew. And I'm gonna introduce you to them one by one in alphabetical order. You guys ready to meet them? Okay, zookeepers, are you ready to meet Xavier X-ray fish? Well, I have my magic letter X card, and let's see him. Ooh, hey, Xavier. Now, X-ray fish are really small fish. They get up to about two inches. That's pretty small. Do you see his fins and his tail? That's to help him swim in the water. And they're pretty friendly fish. They're great to put in a fish tank with other fish because they get along with them so well. Now, let's see if Gertie can sound like an x-ray fish. Hey, Gertie, can you come out? Hey, hang on, I'm taking a shower. I'll be right there. What? Oh, hey, can you help me scrub my back with my scrubber brush? Well, well come on out, let me see. Oh my gosh, what do you want me to do? Well, I need you to help me scrub the back of my neck. Okay. Like a little to the right, to the uh, right. Okay. Yeah. No, a little lower, uh -huh. a little, no, to the left, oh to the gosh, left a little more, Gertie. up, 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 yeah, yeah. Oh yes, perfect, that's right. just This is not a I massage, I'm just trying to yeah. get the dirt off your neck. Yeah, thank you, that's oh. perfect. Okay. Oh, <laughs> that was just the right time to oh. call on me. You're so I was silly. having a real trouble trying to do it myself. Well. The zookeepers and I are just wondering if you know what a x-ray fish sounds like. Hmm. Well, I don't know what they sound like. Um, maybe you can press that button and let me hear it. Well, you know what? Hmm. That's good because really nobody knows what an x-ray fish sounds like. Oh. But we do know what bubbles in a fish tank sounds like. Oh, bubbles in a fish tank. Mm -hmm. Okay. You want to try that? Mm, well, maybe you can press the button to let me hear the bubbles. Okay, let's listen to see what bubbles sound like mm -hmm. in a fish tank. Yeah. Oh. Can you do that? I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. that sounds like you're in the water. Okay. Yeah. Okay. How about this? Bloop, 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 bloop. Bloop, bloop, bloop. How about you, zookeepers? Can you sound like bubbles in a fish tank? That's good, uh, uh -huh. yeah. And we know that letters make sounds too. Uh -huh. Now today the letter is special because we're gonna learn the letter first before we learn the letter sound, okay? okay? Uh -huh. All right, so Gertie, can you touch the word x-ray fish and what letter do you think x-ray fish starts with? Sure, hmm. X-ray fish. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know. That's the letter X. That's right. Uh -huh. The letter X. So let's learn more about the letter X. 
Whole case, uppercase, lowercase game. All right, zookeepers and Gertie, do you think this is the uppercase X or the lowercase X? Hmm. Hmm. I would say it's the lowercase X because it's so small. Mm, you're right. It's Yay! the lowercase uh -huh, X. Uh -huh. Let's see what an uppercase X looks like. Okay. Ooh, it's just a little bigger. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mm-hmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. Now, the letter X has two sounds. Mm. So here's the first sound. <laughs> Can you make that sound? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How about you, zookeepers? <laughs> Excellent. Very mm -hmm. good. Now, do you know any words that begin with tss? Hmm. No. I can't think of any words that begin with the k sound. Hmm. But I can think of words that end with the k sound. Ooh. You want to hear them? Yeah, I want okay. to. Okay. So what about ax? Mm, good. Using an ax. Uh, yeah. An ox. 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 Yes. Like the, the animal. Mm -hmm. And six. Ooh. The number six. Yes. The number six. <laughs> and box and fox. Fox, fox and, and fox. Yes, they all end with the Sound. sound. Very good, sound. Gertie. Yeah. Let's hear the second sound the letter X makes. Hmm. Z. Mm -hmm. Zookeepers, Z. can you make that sound? Z. How about Z. you, Gertie? Z. Mm. Good, Z. good. Mm -hmm. Now, do you know any words that start with the Z sound? Z. Hmm. Yes, xylophone. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Any others? Um, oh, hey, it's in his name, Xavier. That's right. So let's go there. Mm -hmm. Xavier, x-ray fish. Mm -hmm. Okay, Gertie, can you touch the word Xavier and let's listen to the beginning sound. Xavier. Xavier. Mm -hmm. Z -z -z Xavier. Right. Wow. So now we know both sounds mm -hmm. and I can do my letter sound song. Ooh. Oh, let's hear it. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Z -z Xavier. X-ray fish. The letter X has two sounds. Z and X. Z -z Xavier. X-ray fish. The letter X has two sounds. Z and X. <laughs> That's pretty good. You like it? Yeah, it's different, but boy, it's you different. really pulled that off. Yeah. Good job, Gertie. Thank you. <laughs> Let's learn more about x-ray fish. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you know what a baby x-ray fish is called? Hmm. I'll hmm. give you three choices. Okay. Is it called a calf? Hmm. Mm. A hmm. hatchling? Hmm. Or a fry? Hmm. What do you think? What do you think, Gertie? I think it's a hatchling. You do? Yeah. Well, it's actually a fry. What? A fry? You're right. It's a fry. <laughs> <laughs> what? I thought you were kidding. You mean like a French fry? I know. Sometimes I say funny things like French fry, but a baby x-ray fish is actually called a fry. Wow. Okay. Here's the <laughs> next question. That's funny. How long do you think they can live? Do you think they can live about four years mm. or 14 years mm. or 40 years? Mm. What do you think, zookeepers? Gertie? Well, I think four years because they're so tiny. I can't imagine them living any longer. You're right. It's four years. Yay! <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. now I've got my magic video card Lord. and we're going to go on a virtual field trip to see x-ray fish wow Ready? i can't wait here we go there there they are x-ray wow. fish they're in a fish tank mm -hmm. now look real close you can see right through their skin mm -hmm. and you can see their skeleton wow and oh my i can see his backbone you can yeah and that's why they call them x-ray fish. fish. <laughs> oh, I get it. That's great. Okay, zookeepers, do you know what time it is? <gasps> it's story time! time.
It's story time, it's story time. We love it when our stories rhyme. Another animal from our zoo. It's so much fun for me and you. Okay, get ready. Get ready. Okay, let's read our story about Xavier. Mm -hmm. So here's the title. Xavier X-ray fish is extra clean. Mm. And it's written by L.A. Ricketson and illustrated by Ryan Sellers. Mm -hmm. And there's Xavier looking and feeling good. Mm. What do you think this story is going to be about? Hmm. Hmm. Well, let's see. Xavier bathes every day so he can be so clean. Wow. He washes all the seaweed off, the kind that turns you green. <laughs> Soapy suds go everywhere when he's in the tub. Xavier, don't forget your tail. Try giving it a scrub. <laughs> His bar of soap goes back and forth till you can see right through him. <laughs> you would love the way he shines if you only knew him. Mm -hmm. Xavier tries to tell his friends all throughout the zoo, you would feel so nice and clean if you would take baths too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and there he is. He's using his brush and he's getting super mm -hmm. clean. So Gertie, hmm. why is it important for us to keep clean? Well, we wash away germs that can make us sick. Mm, true. And being clean helps us to smell good and to feel good mm. about ourselves too. That's right. Mm -hmm. I guess that's why you were taking your shower earlier. Yeah, I feel good being clean. <laughs> and you smell good, too. Thank you. you smell over here. It smells like roses. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, I've got a question from the story. So, what did Xavier X-ray fish do every day? Hmm. Did he go swimming? Mm. Take a bath? Hmm. Or eat snacks? Hmm. What do you think, zookeepers? Dirty? I know. What? Take a bath. That's right. Yeah. You took a mm -hmm. bath. <laughs> Very good. All right. If you want, you can get your own Xavier X-ray fish story. Mm -hmm. There's a link in the description below. And you can click it, download it, and print it, color, color it, it, read it. And read it. That's right. Yeah. Let's do our zoo, zoo review. review. So today, we learned about okay. the... X-ray fish. That's right. And what habitat do X-ray fish live in? They live in the aquatic habitat. That's right. And what is a baby X-ray fish called? A French fry. No, a fry. A fry. Uh -huh. That's right. And we also learned the uppercase letter X and the lowercase letter X. And the letter X has two sounds. Yeah, and the two sounds are x, x, and z, z. Very good. Yeah. And we made a new friend, Xavier X-ray fish. And we also learned to keep ourselves clean, stay healthy, and feeling good. Mm -hmm. Now, join us for our next show, because we're going to learn about the letter why? Hmm. And what animal do you think starts with the letter Y? Hmm. What do you think? I know, yogurt. That's a snack. <laughs> That's not an animal. Oh. <laughs> okay, so join us oh, well. for our next show. And please subscribe to our channel mm -hmm. so you don't miss any of our shows. Yeah. See you next time. See you next time. We made it all the way through our most lively zoo crew and it was so nice to meet you and now you know what they do if you have any question you can repeat this lesson and you can keep learning friends ah learning never ends